As a decider, president of this great country, I have decided to move forward with the war on terror, to improve security and make Americans even more paranoid. I have made it mandatory as of January 23rd for passports to be carried by air travelers entering the U.S. from that terrorist hotbed, Canada. In order to prioritize the process, I have introduced the Nexus card. <laughs> Rhymes with Texas, except that it's spelled with an uz instead of an ass. <laughs> to get this here Nexus card, all a Canadian has to do is pass a simple security check that involves four-hour interview, fingerprinting, iris scan, urine test, strip search, sitting on a photocopier without pants, <laughs> and completing the daily Sudoku. <laughs> you know, Canada is a potential conduit to America of bioterrorism, disease, and Howie Mandel. <laughs> you like that? Conduit? It's my word of the day. <laughs> Anyways, we have developed a sophisticated special alert system for our border security, which I call how to spot a Canadian. <laughs> the person in question is probably a Canadian if they think the Pittsburgh Penguins would actually move to Kitchener. <laughs> They're probably a Canadian if they look like this. <laughs> They're probably a Canadian if they think the smartest person in their country is this guy. They're probably a Canadian if after a strip search, they're found to be smuggling Timbits. <laughs> they're probably a Canadian if they look like this and think Condoleezza is a hot chick. <laughs> so what exactly does the typical Canadian terrorist look like? Well, here is your stereotypical basic terrorist. And this here is your stereotypical Canadian terrorist. On guard, thank you, and may God help America.